Image copyright AFP image caption condoms cannot be advertised in the daytime in India Indians are questioning the merits of a government order banning condom adverts from being broadcast on primetime TV. The Information and Broadcasting Ministry says the adverts may only be shown between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m. because they could be indecent for children. Some Indians found the directive regressive, but others agreed that many condom ads were vulgar and inappropriate for younger viewers. Talking openly about contraception and is still largely taboo in India. Ministry order cited broadcasting regulations banning indecent, vulgar, suggestive, repulsive or offensive themes. All TV channels are hereby advised not to telecast the advertisements of condoms which are for a particular age group and could be indecent for viewing by children, it said. Child psychologist Akhil Bhagat told the BBC the decision was questionable. If the idea is that it is indecent, then why only restrict condom ads when other types of UAL content are freely available, he said, citing how easy it was for children to access agraphy on the internet. Dr. Bugat said condoms could be a healthy way to start conversations about safe. We should focus on more points of conversation for our children where we can be open with them, rather than worry about them being spoiled. What is more worrying is this decision seems to have been made in a very patriarchal context that does not take choices into account. Many others echoed this sentiment on social media skip Twitter post by Adi Harshada with teenage pregnancy on the rise in India this no condom ad from 610 p.m. is a major setback. We ought to focus on promoting safe. The times have changed and education is more important than it ever was. Harshada Sawant at a Harshada December 12, 2017 end of Twitter post by Adi Harshada skip Twitter post by at Manish Dawari not allowing condom ads 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. is silly. If ASCIM I be unhappy with a provocative ad they should have banned it but to presume that contraception is a nightly necessity smacks of Victorian prudery that mocks the humongous population control challenge. HTTPST.Kodgu8A7 not Manish Dwari at Manish Dwari December 12, 2017 End of Twitter post by at Manish Dwari Others defended the government decision, arguing that the quality of condom ads on Indian television was questionable. Skip Twitter post by Adit Situ on a serious note, no condom ad emphasizes apt why it should be used rather they talk apt pleasure, texture and flavors. It's more like soft. Content should be changed and not banned. Attitude Wally Sweetu Adit Situ December 12, 2017 End of Twitter post by Adit Situ Condom companies objected to the decision. Raymond Groups, which owns the Kama Sutra brand of condoms, told the Economic Times newspaper that not all condom advertising is indecent, adding that they followed industry standards. The Indian Express newspaper said the decision had been taken by the ministry, after India's Advertising Standards Association told them that they could not govern the timings for such ads, based on complaints. This is the second time in recent months that condom ads have come under the spotlight in India, the world's second most populous country with more than 1.3 BN citizens. In September, a condom company was forced to pull an advertisement promoting their popular Manforce brand ahead of the major Hindu festival of Navratri in the western state of Gujarat after protests by some Indians. In 2008 the Madras High Court told condom manufacturers not to have Y pictures on the packaging of their products as this was an affront to Indian culture. Last year the Supreme Court asked one of the country's most senior lawyers to examine condom packaging to see if the pictures on them were too racy and violated obscenity rules.